All right, guys, so I finally got a break, day three here. I'm gonna take an hour, try to run around and get some content for you. Uh, just my voice is gone. Like, I tell everybody, man, this is a marathon, not a race. And uh, yeah, it puts you through it. I mean, it beats you down being here. First time being in a booth all three days. So yeah, it was nice to uh, be able to catch a little bit of break. So swing back over here to Husqvarna real fast. They're actually donating a toy to our toy drive that we do every year for Christmas for the kids with Marines Toys for Tots and a couple local churches. So that was absolutely awesome. So I got to pick it up from them. You didn't think I forgot about the toy, right? Not at all. Awesome. So thank you guys so much for donating the toy. Oh, hi, These guys everybody. are absolutely awesome uh -huh. and uh, donating a toy for our Toys for Tots and uh, we oh, couldn't yeah, be happier. Let me grab one. <laughs> I'll just take this one. It's right here. I'll just take this one. <laughs> See, I get in this booth, I start breaking stuff. Thanks so much. Yeah, absolutely. We appreciate it. And I got you your hat too. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Check that out. Marines Toys for Tots, the drive for the kids, every year Christmas event, Spencer Pro event, let's go. <laughs> Thank you, you so much. You're welcome. It was Thanks a pleasure to meet you. Absolutely. We'll be in co contact very soon, okay? For sure. I appreciate you it. need anything? I don't know, but I know the face. Chicanic. Chicanic. Yes. I didn't want to disrespect you by saying you mechanic, fine. No, but I couldn't good. get it together. I'm Sean. Sean, Spencer so nice Lancare to meet on you. YouTube. Awesome. I'll Chicanic follow. on YouTube, right? Yeah, at me so I can definitely follow you. Absolutely, Thank absolutely. You. What, Check her out, guys. Awesome. Tell them what you do. What do you What do you do? I, I know you. I know what you do because I've seen the videos. But what do you do? My name's Bree. I own a small. Well, I did own a small engine repair shop in Hot Springs, Arkansas, for the last 12 years. I do all the two cycle works, chainsaws, weed eaters, blowers. In my channel, I show everybody how to fix all your own stuff to save you time money and frustration sounds like a good deal right she's giving you guys the behind the scenes stuff yes. you know the stuff that we uh all break and take to her to fix uh -huh. she's gonna make you all look bad <laughs> yeah, you guys need you, to step it up let you know how to fix it all by yourself to save you a lot of money hey it was a pleasure nice Thanks. to meet you Thanks. all right guys we're over here at smart conveyors smart gate conveyors sorry they have a new attachment here that you can put on to any wheelbarrow, I'm assuming? Any wheelbarrow? Yes, any wheelbarrow, basically. And then you can use any of your batteries for, you know, your power tools here. And this baby moves. So I'm going to give you a demonstration. It has a little handle right here, a little little knob. And we're going to give it a run here. I have not done this yet, so uh, this might be embarrassing. Just saying. It actually, it moves, man. Dude, what you guys need here is concrete. We could be doing burnouts. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. Actually, I do that. I do that in our shop just to pass time. It's hilarious. That is, dude. That's, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty darn cool. All right, guys. So I'll show you what else SmartGate has here. You guys know they've been around for years. If you've been to the Equip Expo, you've seen them. So they have an attachment that goes on to your dump truck, dump trailer, and uh, yeah, I'll just let you see the video here. You can dump mulch right out. It has a conveyor system. They have a tube conveyor system that you can actually use. So if you notice there, he was just using one side. You can use the other side as well, or you can use both at the same time. What's a rough estimate retail wise? So the unit that you just saw there is actually sells for right now. Our show pricing is fourteen thousand nine hundred. Okay. And that pricing is going to go up on November fourth. Okay. okay. Uh, it's going to be going up about a thousand bucks, probably up to around fifteen nine, fifteen thousand nine. Still prices? Yeah. Yeah. We we just got word on our way down here as well. Still prices yeah. were adjusting, and yeah. it's all part of being in business now. I'm learning. Yeah, it's part of it. It's it's uh, the way everything goes anymore. I mean, you have to keep up with your product and be able to. Uh, make money on it, not just lose. Right. Not so, just break even, so, Jordan, where can somebody reach out to you or your dad at? Uh, you can find us on uh, Facebook or Instagram at Smartgate Conveyors or our website at SmartgateConveyors.com. Awesome, brother. Thank you Thank so much. You. Thanks for stopping. Pretty darn cool, man. All right, guys. So, unless you've been living under a rock and you're not on Instagram or some other social medias, Yakta. It's everywhere. They're launching here at Equip Expo. They have three models here, which 
basically the front of this mower will separate in seven minutes or less just by lifting this and doing a few other little adjustments uh, you can pretty much separate the back half of this mower right here and drive this away and then you can put on different attachments which is pretty darn cool bring it down here they got the snow blower right now and they're gonna have a whole host of other attachments as well so kind of give you an idea of the difference so same back end really just splits in this general area so Yakta actually has two booths here and they have this one with the mower actually split so I saw it here I wanted to show you guys exactly how this kind of works so let's go inside they gave me permission to take you guys inside the booth so right here is that lever I was showing you over there you just basically pull it up here and what that does is disconnects these two hooks on each side okay from up underneath of here and it connects into these two pins and then your electrical will actually plug in here on each side and you'll be able to operate the unit uh, with power say you're putting a snow blower or something like that on the front of it they have a whole host of attachments they're gonna do and uh, yeah anyways so that's it separated right here back you guys out so you can kind of get a little better look at it that's pretty darn cool and then this is how the back half will actually ride without it so it kind of has like a counterbalance until you get connected and everything and then it'll have a quick release here you can just see a pin and you know key or whatever and uh yeah pull it out of there and let it rip has a really good engine on there nice and strong looks nice and clean and uh yeah i'd say yakta is uh innovating for sure that's really really cool looking here's their stand on over here big and beefy i will say that and uh i'm about to check it out and if there's anything that i really want to show you guys there right now i'll show you in one second what's up brother how are you sean up, spencer lawn care what is it sean spencer lawn care spencer lawn care what's up my name is george i'm from princess cut lawn care uh, we do DIY stuff. Yeah, YouTube? Yeah. yeah, YouTube, yeah. Just YouTube or other ones? Yeah, just YouTube pretty Can much. I keep this? Yeah, yeah, sure, awesome, man. man. So we're Spencer Long here on YouTube, so. Oh, nice, it's nice awesome. to meet you guys. Actually, I think I've seen some of your videos. You're on the pro side, right? Yeah, kind of, I guess. We're, we're a little bit all over the place. We just launched our product line here this year, so. Nice. I love coming down here where the innovation's happening. You know, the, the folks that aren't as big as, as the other end and showcasing a lot of them, so. Yeah, that's awesome. I ran into you as well. So what is, uh, I guess, your target audience? Yeah. Yeah, so our target audience pretty much is we're working on we deal with like new homeowners or homeowners that are looking to improve their lawn so we're pretty much just like the diy lawn care, lawn care space okay so basically your house yes okay so you probably know like alan hayne oh your yeah buddy alan hayne nut. lawn care nut so that's kind of like same thing he does yep that's really really cool yep yeah this is spencer from spencer lawn care oh, oh yeah hi. this is my wife here she's the brains behind the What's operation your name? uh vicky vicky yeah nice to meet you, vicky. Nice to meet you. yeah that's really cool I, and guys, I get asked all the time, this is a thing, and this is a true testament, how long you guys been on YouTube? Uh, we started in the beginning of the pandemic in 2020. Okay, how many subscribers you have? Uh, we're at about 80,000. 80,000 subscribers, guys, and I tell people all the time because they're like, hey, haven't you seen such and such? And it's so big now that it's inevitable. There's people that you've never met before that are doing this with large following. So you can't take it as disrespectful. There's just so many people now doing it. So that's awesome. I ran into you guys. I appreciate that, man. And, uh, it was totally on accident. I seen the gentleman giving a speech about uh, the cowboy cauldrons. cauldrons. That yeah. looked pretty darn cool. And yeah, accidentally ran into you. So yeah, we're, we're actually neat, working yeah. on like a GIE recap video right now, just trying <laughs> to show off some of the products and stuff like that. So that's why we're here. This looks pretty interesting. Very cool. Follow them, guys. Princess Cut Lawn Long Care. Princess Cut Lawn Care. Awesome. All right, guys. I seen something really cool here. We're here with Mike the builder founder he's got all of the uh good letters around his name and he built something really cool here mike would you like to tell our audience about what you built here for sure thanks so much yeah i'm mike bertelson i'm the owner and founder of cowboy cauldron company we make and sell what we believe is the world's finest fire pit and grill and uh if you'll bear with us for a couple minutes here maybe you'll agree so they are meant to be lifetime investments they they will last generations not not years um our smallest unit is called the dude it's a 35 pound basin um, segmented legs it's meant to be able to take with you to the beach to the ski hill to your buddy's house to the park or just to sit in your backyard it's our most popular unit extremely versatile and uh, they sell really well and 
The next size is the Urban Cowboy. It's got a 30 inch base, and this basin weighs uh, 75 pounds as opposed to the Urban Cowboy, which is 35. It's taller, as you might guess, the name Urban Cowboys is designed to be set up in and around backyards on patios, etc. Moving to the next one, the next biggest unit is called the Wrangler, 36 inch basin, it weighs 130 pounds. It's uh, arguably our most versatile unit. Professional chefs and folks who are using them on larger spaces, bigger yards, tend to go with this one. It's really beautiful, really fun, and it's a relatively easy move. If you want space in your yard back for a party or something else, you can move it as you wish. Our largest unit is called the Range Box. It's a big burly one, it's our flagship, it's the one that started the entire business. At 220 pounds and 42 inches in diameter, it's, uh, it's substantial. It's got a tremendous amount of visual gravitas. People love them. They end up in resorts, vineyards, uh, fancy hotels, and backyards all over the world. We've shipped cauldrons to virtually every part of the globe. We don't have one in Antarctica yet, but there's not a lot of wood there. If you have any questions for us, by all means, just reach out to cowboycauldron.com. That's C-A-U-L-D-R-O-N. If you have any questions, there will be someone, a uh, live person on the phone, will answer questions within 48 hours. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you, Mike. These are cool, guys. I'm telling you, go check them out. I think every man is going to need one of these in his backyard for sure. All right, guys. Andrew's talking to people, so I'm not going to bother him, but I did want to show him some love. He came by our booth this morning. We're over here at Mulch Mule. We got a Toro with the mulch bucket out front. As you can see right there, the mulch force kind of hidden behind folks. It's really busy here right now. Professional grade mulch trailer. I'll say it like that. We showcased this on the channel last year. Really, really cool. Built locally to us as well in Ohio. And uh, from the way I understand it, innovative innovated pretty close to home as well so i won't give any or share any of those details but check it out wanted to show you guys this with the billy goat out on the front of it blows right into the front sits on a nice big trailer here can move some serious serious material and also back up and compact and uh, get rid of a ton of material as well so ls tractors has a camo pattern figured i'd share this with my good buddy nate bissell maple farms he uh, absolutely loves the LS tractors, and uh, yeah, they produce a really nice tractor. They got a really good looking booth here as well, so cool to see him here at the Equip Expo, and not just the Farm and Garden Show, but something I always like checking out here at the Equip Expo is the snow stuff, and Snow X has always been a big leader over here at the GIE and now Equip Expo. Always have a really great booth. Their guys and gals that are in the booth are always very professional and get you taken care of. So I figured I'd give them a shout out and at least showcase some of what they have going on if you potentially want to come to the show next year in 2024. Cool, so cool. Take care, guys. Right. Yeah, have a good day. All right. So I got sidetracked real quick talking to those guys. Big shout out to them. And uh, anyways, Snow X is really, really good here at the Equip Expo. Always very professional. So I want to give them a big shout out as well. Just in case you happen to want to come to the show next year, just remember you can use code SPENCER to save yourself 50%. All right, guys, I'm in the next lane over. Cameron's on an electric scooter thing. Oh, oh. I wasn't going to put any pressure on him, but I also wanted to film if he happened to uh, put himself out of commission. So, Cameron, we're too old, too old for all that, man. Too old for all that. He don't even know I'm filming him right now. Anyways, we're going to keep on moving on here. I want to see some stuff while I got some time here. <laughs> Cameron, I give it about a... I'll give it a... I'll give it a solid five out of 10, just because you actually got on that and uh, tried it, because you ain't getting shot on that thing, I'll tell you that right now. But I spotted something really cool here, I wanna show you guys. So, that is cool. That is really cool. Mini truck, Noah owns one of these, and uh, they got a snow plow out on the front of this thing, and a mini little salt spreader in the back. So, that thing was just a little bit smaller. That would be one heck of a sidewalk machine, wouldn't it? I know Noah likes this thing, so I figured I'd show it to you guys. Look at this little guy. Hey, and you can buy it right now for 34,000 bucks. That is a cool looking little truck. Look who's on the screen right here over at LMN. 
Old Almond Landscape, Caleb and Brittany. Big shout out to you guys, big shout out to LMN, big shout out to Mark Bradley. Always uh, great friends of Spencer Lock here and uh, what we do here. If you need a good, great CRM company, check out LMN and uh, yeah, you can't go wrong there. So big shout out to these guys. Everybody looks busy or I'd stop in and say hi. I don't see Mark here this year or at this time while I'm here. So what's up guys? Wanted to say hi to you really quickly and uh, yeah, gives you an idea right there. So great choice. Pro is 335, sorry. Pro Plus is 460. And then you have your Pro Plus Greenius, which is 557. So I know they launched Greenius there as well and uh, are doing things. So go check them out. So I'm out here showcasing folks that don't get all of the attention from being in the big show here. And also, I'm showcasing the folks that have been very supportive of us, of us at Spencer Lawn Care and worked with us off and on throughout the years, whether we work with them or not. And uh, yeah, just showing some love. I'm currently trying to find Wright. I wanna swing by and say hi to Ed. And uh, yeah, I'm uh, like, you gotta, guys, you could like literally get lost in this place. Like, I'm like probably dead middle. And then this goes around, and then on the other side of the food court, they have like this drone zone, so like, I need to get my app out here. My app, yeah, they have a Equip Expo app, and you can follow and search all of the different booths, and I gotta find uh, good old Wright. I made it over here to Wright. I'm gonna show you the LG, which is their newest model. Uh, Ed put a video up on their YouTube channel as well. You can check it out more in depth, and he tells you all about it. it looks like a solid unit. My buddy Mike ran it. Looks really, really good and uh, he had nothing but good things to say about it. I personally right now don't see Ed. Uh, he could be in the restroom or whatever, but you know, I'm still gonna show it while I'm here and we're gonna continue moving on. What do you guys think of it? Honest opinion, what do you guys think of it? It's all we use. Yeah? Yeah, Standard X. Yeah, man. Nice, man. What do you guys think about the new LG? Checked it out yet? Yeah, it's yeah. fast. We got a you demo like it? One. Yeah. Awesome, awesome. Demo, right? What's that? Demo first, then we try it. Yeah. yeah. Try Great it thing about it. Equip, right? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, guys. I appreciate you giving me feedback. All right, no Peace. problem. So let's go ahead and sneak in here. It looks like this side opened up a little bit. So this is the all new standard LG. Look at that big weight kit out on the front. Looks like they got a nice bagger on it. Nice little bucket on the side here as well. Aero core deck. You watch this. Very cool. So I guess you just slide on in here. So step in here. Obviously watch your step a little bit coming back out. But big old unit on the back side, hence why they have the nice weights out on the front of it. Nice big three bagger. That is a huge bagger. And uh yeah, definitely get the job done for sure. Has the back system on the side of it. Swung over here to Ferris. Mainly because a ton of you have been asking me about making a flex shoot for the Z1, Z2, and Z3, which we've ran the Z3 on the channel before, and it's a great unit, heavy duty. I'd say same comparative to like the Toro HDX and right ZK, they're just big, big zero turns. I think this unit here could be something that we could definitely produce for. This is their small one, the Z1, Z2, and then down there to Z3. I'm not gonna impede on that gentleman doing this thing. But uh, yeah, I think uh, I think this is a unit for sure we can retrofit and modify a flex shoot to uh, come up. The only thing I really see in the way is the battery box just a little bit. Yeah. But but it's it's kind of. I see a hinge point here possibly to maybe even access to this one up here. So yeah, I think maybe we can make that happen for you guys for sure. Huh. Same thing here, just looks like the battery box, you know, is there. And then there's a small one here as well, so. How are you guys? Great, sir. How are you? Good, good. You guys enjoying the show? Absolutely, sir. Absolutely. Awesome, man. From Zeppins. Zeppins, take care. So, uh, everybody's cool, man. Just come here, have a good time. You know, funny thing is, a long time ago, we'd get thrown out of these booths, you know? Like, they'd be like, no filming whatsoever. Man, 
Look at these guys. I can't even believe they let you guys in here. I can't believe they let you record us. Yeah. The goat. Hey, back in the day, man, they used to throw us out of these booths. People forget about that. They'd be like, hey, no filming, no get filming. out. Yeah. I got through out two years ago. Did you? The company that, that threw me out, it's not here this year. It was because they threw him out. That's because we put a word in. Yep. May have. Hey. I appreciate the ghost fool. Uh, Sean, while you're on camera, how's everything going? It's really Special well. Products. First time getting away, I took an hour here. Look, I said, hey, I have to get some film in for the, you know, our folks that are watching that might not know about the show, might not know what's going on here. And there's new people coming into the industry every single year. So yeah. And, yeah. I wanted to get them some content. Took a break. They got it. You got eight people down there in that booth running. So if they can't keep it under wraps, you know, they're all fired. <laughs> <laughs> Except one. There's one there. That you can't fire. She may go back her. Yeah, you, she you might fire me. Fired. Yeah, you may exactly. get fired. I took a picture with you the other day, man, and I moved my hand and it was flirt. Oh yeah? yeah. You want to take another one? Please, sir, if you don't mind. Alright, let me cut this off. We'll be back. Hey, if you guys don't know Mitchell's Harris the property manager. Yeah. Go check them out, guys. Instagram, Has YouTube. Management LLC on YouTube and Instagram. Oh, yeah? Just those two? No TikTok, no Facebook, no, no nothing else? What, Facebook is what? Oh, Facebook as well. Yes, uh, Any more? That's it. Done. You sure? Possible. Last chance. Last 100%. call. Done. Mitchell? So this is how you keep it simple. At Mythco underscore outdoor, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. There call you go, me, guys. 911. So, another friend and supporter of Spencer Lawn Care throughout the years. Echo, we absolutely love Echo, and uh, they have a huge booth here, and they uh, they run a program still called the EMB, and I know they've had a lot of changes there, so if you haven't been following those guys, go give them all a follow. They're very loyal to what they've been doing, and uh, they deserve all the successes that they have with it now. But I figured I'd just swing through here real quick and uh, show you guys what they have going on. Looks like they're printing some shirts back there, and uh, yeah. Big shout out to Echo here. Super busy over here at Cujo's. Sean and them rocking it, their whole team. His dad, great people. Uh, I'm not gonna go in there because it is swamped. They've been swamped every time I've come by, which is probably like six times. So uh, yeah, I'm not gonna slow down business. They're absolutely killing it. Remember if you wanna buy those online, Coach Spencer will save you some money there. Big shout out to Cujo. You're still on your feet, man. Yes. Had to come down here and show you guys some love. Good, hey, this is Matt, guys, with Equipment Defender. How's the show going for you guys? Doing good, doing good. This show's always great. Yeah. It's always a good time here. Good people, busy. I love it. Absolutely. I can do this every day. Uh, you want to showcase anything? Uh, you know, I guess what you guys have at the show here or something you think everybody might like? Or? Sure, we got blower racks. As you know, I know you use them. Yep. Every make and model, fully adjustable, fully lockable. Open our enclosed trailers makes it very easy to get your equipment in and out and secure. But beyond that, we have racks for any sort of handheld power equipment that you have. Yep. Easy bolt on, guys. Your trailers, enclosed trailers, you name it. Hedge trimmers. I think you guys have a chainsaw right yep, now. Yep, we have chainsaw racks, hedge trimmer racks. Multi tools. Combi systems for your PAS tools, yes. Awesome. Remember, you guys can use code SPENCER to save yourself 10% at EquipmentDefender.com. So one of the things we always wanted to do anytime we're doing any kind of show is we want to give back to you as much as we possibly can. So we work with a lot of brands like Toro themselves, Kohler Engines, Kawasaki, and others as well that really help us to give back to this community. This year, Savannah and I decided that all the gifts were going to come from us personally and uh, out of our own pocket because this is our product line and it's a whole new venture for us. So this is Spencer Products, just a, 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 another product of Spencer Lawn Care and Spencer Media and Spencer Storage and Spencer Everything, I guess you could say at this point. But anyways, our first product is the Flex Shoot here. It's a completely commercial grade shoot blocker from bottom to top. And uh, this thing is overbuilt and uh, I couldn't be more happier with how it ended up turning out. I started this with Savannah about six days before COVID kicked off. We never anticipated the journey we were about to be on and uh, it got shelved immediately for about 16 to 18 months and then we came back to it uh, last year sometime and then we're now just about six weeks ago officially launching this. So it's been a lot of ups and downs, a lot of wasted money and you know working with people uh, and you know figuring things out. So feel free to check it out after we do our little spiel here but uh, we're super proud of it. We built this thing for you guys, the landscape 
landscapers in the industry. You can bang and clank this thing, and I truly believe it is the best shoe blocker on the market, and I put my word behind it and my brand behind it. This thing is built heavy duty. It may not be for everybody, but it's for the landscaper that, you know, if he's gonna spend his hard-earned money with us, you know, he's gonna get his money worth, and you know that as soon as you grab a hold of it, and uh, you're gonna know it as soon as you get to running it. So, I'll give you guys a quick demonstration. It opens all the way up. Closes all the way, and it also has a quarter feature that allows a little bit of the deck compression to leave the deck. It does help with mulching if you close it all the way if you're running mulching blades, but it is not a mulching kit by any means. That's uh, our flex shoot with Spencer products. Our other one that will be released in 2024 is, we're calling it TB1. It just stands for Trash Bucket 1. Trash sucks, right? Anybody here really like picking up trash when you're mowing? No. Nah, it stinks, right? So we wanted to make it easier for you. So that's what I, just, I set out here to do. You can uh, put your little catcher in here. It looks like we may have bent this one a little bit. But anyways, grab your trash stain on the mower, put it in the trash bucket, go ahead and put it back into place, get back to mowing. Whenever you're done with the job, pull up to the dumpster on a commercial, pull up to a trash can at the residential property. Click the quick release here, lock your hook into place, dump your trash out in the can, get back to work, put it back into place. You can use any bucket. It will come with our Spencer product bucket at the beginning of 2024. Get back on your mower, get back to making money, get back to being profitable. With that being said, it's time to do a giveaway, right? It's done. Like I said, it is not this mower. I want to make it very, very clear. Next year, we'll hope to be able to do that here, and uh, hopefully we're back. We're going to evaluate everything. This is a, a large step for us, so we're going to go back, and we'll see how it all draws out on the, the drawing board. So there was a young man I saw earlier. Uh, you did yesterday, so I'm not going to let you do again today. There was another young man somewhere around here, right here in front of me. You want to pick the winning ticket? Yeah. Come over here right by TQ. You reach Don't in there. Everybody got the ticket. Right here, young man. You want me to read it out? Oh man, oh, don't you peek at that. I see you trying to look up close. <laughs> uh-huh. Y'all got your tickets? So I still haven't told you what you won, but I guarantee it'll at least be worth your time. Yell a little louder. Seven. Oh. Six. Seven. Nine. Four. One. Nine four one. Nine four one. Seven six seven. Nine four one. All right, so we do a traditional thing here. Take this. Next. It's a sixty second countdown, but you guys have to do it. I'm not gonna get put in that spot. Sixty. We didn't do sixty seconds. How about ten? Yes. Thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. They done, Spencer. They done. Put his hand to the side. They sleeping on the floor. Nobody. <laughs> they ain't here. All right. Go ahead and pick another one, bud. <laughs> hey, great job. Yeah, All right, you guys ready? Yeah. Seven, six, seven, eight, six, one. Uh, you? Seven, six, seven, eight, six, one. Eight. That's right. Seven, six, seven, eight, six, one. Eight, six, one. Yeah. 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 Let me see the ticket. Hold up. Hold up. Oh. 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 I have been fooled before. I'm just going to let you know that. He is yeah. the winner. Yeah. So, obviously there's nothing here you won, right? Right. Yep. But I do want to say congratulations to you. Savannah and myself decided, you know, it's expensive to come to this show. It takes time out of your work week. So, we wanted to give cash. Okay. We want it to be worth your time. So I wouldn't waste your guys' time ever. So go ahead and put your hand out here, sir. These are all $100 bills. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand dollars. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Give TQ a round of applause yeah. too.
and also thank you to thank each and every one of you guys. We appreciate you. We hope to be back next year. We're gonna go bigger and better than ever. We love you all. Please don't ever think we take it for granted. Thank you guys. Enjoy the rest of the show. All right, guys, so there we have it. Equip Expo 2023 is in the book. We just got done getting hooked up over here with Trent from Mega Attachments, getting everything hooked up on his trailer, getting our truck loaded up as well. Everybody else is getting loaded up as well. And uh, yeah, that's a wrap, man. A successful event. I'm stoked. I'm tired. It's time to head back home. We got about a five hour drive or so. Let's go. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, keep on, keep growing, keep making money, boys. Talk to you later. TQL. Peace. Bye.